Hi friends, through this video we will learn about the basic characteristic of queuing system. The basic characteristic of queuing system is having five components. The first one is the input, service mechanism, second one and queue discipline, next system capacity and finally customer behavior. These are the five characteristic of queuing system. First we will look about the first characteristic input. Input is nothing how the customer getting inside the queue and that is we are calling that one as arrival pattern. The arrival pattern is measured by the arrival rate. That process is assumed to be a poison process. The arrival rate lambda should be calculated by the formula the number of arrival per unit time. It also follows the Poisson distribution. And you have to know the inter-arrival time also. The inter-arrival time terminology should be calculated. It is uh, the reciprocal of the corresponding the arrival rate. That is 1 by lambda. Actually, the arrival rate should be denoted by the notation lambda. The second characteristic is service mechanism. That is how they are getting service and what manner they are getting service. That service state should be denoted as mu and the formula for the service rate it should be measured by the number of customers serviced per unit time and it follows an exponential distribution. The number of servers may be finite or infinite. If it is finite means we are denoting that one by C. The arrangement of service servers may be a series or parallel. Series means the server servers are that is in a system you are having a mini service. For example, if you are going for a clinic, you are not at all getting a one service. Sequentially, we are getting service. First, you have to meet a doctor, and after meeting doctor, you have to go for to get a medicine in medical shop. And after you have to go for to put an injection in an injection room and and this is called what series of servers if you are having this scenario like that it is a series of servers and sometimes in your uh, in your queue situation it's uh, different compared to the instead of series you have a parallel server. in a multi server queue there are number of channels providing the identical server service facility. That's also there. The next characteristic is queuing queue discipline. The queue discipline having the four types. One is first come, first served or first in, first out. Second one is last come, first served and last in, first out. The third scenario is selection in random order. And the fourth one is superiority in selection. So this queue discipline is the manner which the customer are selected for service in queue as formula. The first come as first served means those who are coming first, they are getting service first. Last come first means those who are coming last, they are getting first service. Looking like that selection in random and periodic basis are some other queuing discipline. Next system capacity. The system capacity means how many person may stand in the queue or otherwise how many person can occupy in the queue. That it may be a finite or infinite. Example, if you are going for a grocery shop, in the grocery shop the queue may be uh, not having any restriction the queue capacity may be the infinite any number of the customers coming for the grocery shop it doesn't uh, doesn't a problem for the corresponding person to uh, those who are giving a service but if you are going for some uh, ration shop or some other thing in your village there is a restriction uh, the only person in the village can stand in the queue. On that time, the capacity of the corresponding queue must be finite. These are the example for the system capacity. 
and next important thing of the, the characteristic of Q is customer behavior the customer behavior is a reaction of the customer upon upon entering the system it's classified by the following one is balking and reneging jockeying and conclusion periodicity balking means if a customer decide not to enter the queue upon arrival he said have balked example you are going for to get a ticket for to see some film in a theater on the time if you are looking the queue the queue is very huge and the bulk number of strength is there in that queue so that's why you decided not to enter in the queue so this is called balking reneging sometimes a customer may enter in the queue but after he may decide to leave the queue due to impatience jockeying is jockeying is apt to happen not in a single server if you have many servers on the time the person standing in a one queue to getting a service is decided to jump on the another queue in the system collision several customers may cooperate and only one of them may stand in the queue instead of many person the one person is entering in the queue that must be the pollution periodicity in certain cases some customers are served before other regardless other uh, regardless of their order of arrival next you have to know transition state if the characteristic of the queuing system are dependent on time then we can call that the corresponding system is in transition state steady state it is an opposite of transition state if the characteristic of queuing system are independent of time means we can call that one that corresponding system be in steady state in the next video we'll look on kindal notation thank you